Hi, my name is Lizzie, and today I'm going to give you some of my tips on how to prepare for VidCon. This year will be my fourth VidCon, so I've had some experience with these things. My first tip would be to take a look at the VidCon agenda. Go check the website, and if it's not on there, it will be in the booklets that you get whenever you sign in. You get a little backpack, and it's got all these goodies in it, and your agenda will be in there. I believe they'll also have the app that you can download that has the agenda, and where to go for signings, and like a map, and all these other cool features, so you should check out the app. A lot of cool things will be happening at the same times, and you have to kind of pick and choose who you want to see when. If you want to see someone perform, you might have to sacrifice seeing their panel as well. You just kind of have to prioritize, and most of all, make sure you go see John Cozart's Q&A, because guess who's gonna be moderating? This girl right here. And also make sure you have time to hang out with your friends and eat food, because those are two very important things at VidCon. My second tip is that you're going to be waiting in lines probably for a long time if you're in the signings or if you're in the meet and greets. And that's where this little guy becomes your best friend all over again. You thought you loved it now, wait till you have to wait in line for a couple of hours. And of course you've got all the social media apps to keep you occupied during this time. Um, but you might not have service because that is kind of a tricky thing to get at VidCon. So there are podcasts, there are audiobooks, and there are games. This game that I've been playing recently is called Best Fiends. You play these cute little bug characters and you're fighting these mean slugs and you match up their little shapes that correspond with them and you defeat the slugs. Be sure you get it now because in celebration of Father's Day, Best Fiends is giving away a free gift to all players on June 19th. It's super fun and there's tons of levels and side quests to do so it can last forever as long as you're in that VidCon line. I'm happy to say that they're sponsoring this video and you can download the game for free in the link below in the description. And in playing those games, listening to those podcasts, and listening to those audiobooks, your phone's gonna run out of battery pretty fast, you're gonna be taking selfies, you're gonna be taking videos, you're gonna be vlogging, you're gonna need an external battery charger for your phone. James got this on Amazon for 22 bucks and it can charge a phone four times super fast. So link in the description if you wanna buy this. My next tip would be to bring your own snacks and a water bottle. You're already paying for your hotel, you're already paying for your flight maybe, and you're paying for your VidCon ticket, everything is so expensive, you should bring your own snacks. There's like a CVS within walking distance. You can go there if you don't want to carry it all on your flight, or you can't. I mean, like goldfish, crackers, um, I don't, I don't, granola bars, nuts. And you know, just snacks, just snacks to keep in your little bag so that you don't starve to death when you're waiting in line for hours and walking around all the day. All the day. <laughs> Who says that? And drink water because you children will be dehydrated and I can't have that. I'm your mother. While I'm being your mother, you need to wear sunscreen, young lady and sir and in between. But really though, I didn't wear sunscreen when I went to Ren Faire and I got a severe burn on my back and I'm still recovering from it. Another tip, if you are a video creator or in the industry, in some capacity, you should have a little business card. I made these for my first few VidCons and it really helped when meeting new people, meeting people in the industry, making new friends because everyone wants to follow you on social media, see what you do, see who you are. It's a really easy way to just promo yourself, just self-promo, boop, 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 boop. But I would reserve it for people that you're actually talking to and you make a connection with and don't just like hand it out to random people because they're not gonna care, they're gonna throw that away. I have so many thrown away VidCon business cards that I just didn't even think about because random people handed them to me. I think my last tip, especially in light of everything that has been going on, is just be aware of your surroundings, be safe. If you ever feel like you're in trouble, I will link below to the VidCon blog about all the safety precautions they're taking this year and like the numbers to call there's a VidCon hotline. Just be safe, have fun, and enjoy YouTube and its people because it's so fun. It really is so fun. I'm so excited. I can't wait to meet all of you that I haven't met already. The ones that I have met, I'm gonna see you again and I'm so excited. I'm so excited to be my friends and just hang and be cool YouTube kids. Okay, um, that's everything I got for you today. I will see you at VidCon next weekend! Bye! Oh my god! Oh no! Oh no! This movie's gonna mess me up!